Good morning, good morning, everybody. How are you? I'm just having to take this for you because I went live yesterday on iSlick and it didn't save. Ah! <laughs> technology, technology. Okay, this is in regards to the habit tracker. Okay, so um, I have a free um, giveaway <clears throat> down below under products and it's called the habit tracker. And I wanted to show you, this is the habit tracker. Okay. I'm going to get a little closer and show you that up above, you're going to, you're going to put a habit on there. And then this is 30 columns for you to check mark when you've completed this habit every day. Okay. Do you see that? Oh, sorry. Would help if I showed you the right part and then it goes to 30. You see that? Now, what I want to tell you is when you go to print this, you want to make sure you click on fit or fit to page, whatever your printer says. Because if not, like me yesterday, I didn't do fit and you see how it comes out? It cuts off. So you only get 29 days. All right. So that's the difference. Okay. So what do you do with this? Well, it is a fact that the only way to replace a bad habit is with a good habit. Okay. That's it. So if you have a bad habit, um, whatever that is, I want you to think of something you can do that could replace that habit. For instance, my husband used to chew tobacco. And so he had the need to have that something in his lip, right? Or right in here, inside, tucked in there. So he started putting paper in there, something that just mimics the same habit. And that's, that's, um, probably not the best. Um, let's see what else. Well, okay. So if you have a bad habit of not cleaning your face, well then at night before you go to bed, then you need to have the new habit of cleaning your face at night before you go to bed. If that's something that you want, it's all about what you want. This is about you. What is it you want? What good habits do you want in your life? That's what this tracker is all about. Okay. And maybe you need to start with the bad habits, but I don't want you to give any power to those bad habits whatsoever. Okay. All I want you to think about is anything that you consider a bad habit. I want you to think of a good habit you would love to have implemented in your life. And I want you to replace that bad, bad habit with the good habit. Okay. And I want you to replace it. Okay. Just replace it. Okay. That bad habit. We're just replacing it. We're not giving it any energy. We're just replacing it with whatever your good habit is. That's what I want you to give the power to. That's what I want you to get passionate about. And I want you to attach the proper feeling to that um, new habit and you know, whatever you need to do to remember that good habit, you know, attach an amazing feeling to it. Um, have flashcards, whatever it takes, something that gets you into that good habit. And every time I want you to write down whatever that good habit is, um, I list your good habit, do this and it makes me feel, and then attach a feeling to it. Something that really touches you about that habit. I want you to really charge it with some amazing emotion. Okay. If you do that and it's going to take you, they tell you it's 21 days to replace a bad habit with a good one. And that's not true. It takes about 90. All right. I'm sorry. 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 But that's how it is. But if you really think about it, I want you to stop and think about that. Anybody can do something for 21 days. They can. It's been proven. Have you not seen these people that have these challenges at the gym, a 30 day challenge? Um, they, anybody can do that. They can accomplish. I'm not saying it's easy to do a 30 day challenge. What I'm telling you is anybody can do anything for 30 days and then you stop. A new habit is just that it's a habit, meaning it's something that you do all the time. This isn't something that you're just challenge to do for a period of time. This is, this is a forever thing. You want this new habit. So you're going to, you're going to do this a minimum of three times 
the same new habit, a minimum, until it just becomes something that you're just doing. You're not even thinking about it anymore because it has become a habit. And, and you've replaced it with that other habit that you don't like. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you enjoy this. I want to hear from you. Tell me, tell me what you're replacing. And um, yeah, I want to hear about your progress. I hope you enjoy this. All right, guys, talk to you later. Bye now.